and we're back in business. Awesome. Well, good day, everyone, and thanks for joining me. What is this afternoon here at the moment? I've got stuff um, done pretty quick today, and uh, I've packed up for the night, and now I'm just messing around uh, a little bit on YouTube, and uh, I'm going to try to work out the live streaming thing on there. Hopefully, I can get it sorted out. You never know, and we might go live there one day. Maybe it'll be up on the screen, maybe it won't. I've got no idea, but um, that's what the idea for this afternoon is anyway, or for the rest of the afternoon. Anyway, um, what have we been up to this week? Well, we've been sowing a lot of grass seed, and uh, yeah, I've got a drone. Another one. Don't think that was it. There it is there. The new drone, so I'm pretty pleased about that. We are really back in business now, but I really do have to be a lot more careful with it. Um, I was flying by the seat of my pants before, but now, uh, as I said, I need to be a whole lot more careful with it to make sure I don't crash this one. I still haven't fixed the other one yet, but uh, I'll be doing that during the week and we might make a video on that to show you what's wrong with it and how I intend to fix it. Anyway, let's get on with this video. It's only a short one, but uh, it'll show you what I've been up to this week. So I learned my lesson with the other one. I've uh, installed the propeller guards. So let's see how it goes. Doesn't seem to be any problem. So maybe it's just a bit more touchy in the wind, but uh, it's not too much of a problem, I don't think. Okay, so I think I might just leave those on for a little while and not fly it in you know, high winds. I think that's, they're going to actually protect it pretty good although I'm staying away from trees from now on. One of the pains that you always have when you're not on town water is to conserve water for your house and uh, also make sure that you've got enough over the summer. Well, now we're heading into winter. We need to still transfer some water. We've got a bit of a setup here on the back of a four-wheeler. This pipe here goes into the water tank behind me. Uh, this one here is going up into the house tank. So we're going to transfer... Uh, probably a thousand litres of water out of this tank up into the house tank and uh, that'll get us through a little while more until we get some more rain. Yep, sounds like that's going in. Okay, so we got ourselves a MIG welder here today. Uh, got it this morning. Gasless MIG. Um, so we're just going to pack it. Have a look at it. See what it's like. Looks like she's done up pretty good. Right, that's that one out. There's that one out. Now, take the plastic off. Quite a neat little job. Everything's already attached to it, so that's good. Um, the earth clamp, welding nozzle, excellent. Now, I reckon I should read the instruction booklet. Normally I wouldn't. I can uh, arc weld a little bit but when it comes to MIG welding I've got no idea. Right so I've got the spool on here uh, and it seems to be feeding the wire through. It does seem to be working okay we might just plug it in again and try it again. Yep working beautifully. Right so I got the new MIG welder the other day a little boss weld from Bunnings actually 
and very, very surprised with it. It is absolutely fantastic. So um, if anyone's after a little MIG welder and you want one that's easy to use with easy settings and everything on it, get your hands on one of these. Probably can't see that, but there is a big eagle. Found a dead animal down there. Now he's flown off. Oh, there's actually, there's actually a pair of them. It's a bit hard to see because of the zoom on these phones aren't real flash, but yeah, a pair of eagles up there. Anyway, that's all I've got for you today. Um, as I said, it was only a short video, but uh, hopefully you found it enjoyable as I did making it. Um, so I'm off to get this live stream working if I can. I really hope everyone has a happy and safe Easter. Take care on the roads, don't drink too much, and eat plenty of chocolate. Catch you next time.